Look here, cool kids, better brush your teeth. Ain't nothing else worse than a cavity. Subscribe, Icon RCs, Mobay 876RC, True Boy RC, Gap Reviews A to Z, Life of Coach D. Last but not least, me, Rattle Can Olexan. Thanks. Aha! Uh -huh. We're here to talk about this monster truck infraction. This is what I've converted it to. Um, put a set of uh, Italian tires on here. The Qatars, I think that's what they're called. Just a quick little run with it. See how it how it kind of holds up out here. Um, okay, it's it's moving as y'all can see. It's 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 moving pretty well. Um, seems like it has a little bit more, I guess, torque or less traction than than with the back flips on it. Just whip it around a little bit, kick up a little dirt. But yeah, I like it. I like the size of this rig. Um, I like the way it handles. It stays pretty planted. It's pretty stable. Um, and of course, you you all know how I did it. Um, I did a couple videos back, but basically took apart an outcast, put everything on a infraction chassis to make it an armor infraction monster truck. Um, I ran it back then with backflips on it just to kind of see how, how I liked it. Um, I didn't, I couldn't find a body for the longest. Um, this body that's on here now is actually a body from a short course truck. Um, got the idea from Gat Reviews. He let me test fit his uh, Sentin 3S stock body. And it actually worked out pretty well. I had to cut the, the wheel wells out a little bit. So the back flips wouldn't cause me any issues with the body, but overall it actually fit pretty nice. So I then decided to go get me an actual short course body. Cut it up, mounted it, and this is what we came, and of course, you know, I painted it, but this is what we came up with. Um, and I actually like it, I actually like it. So just whipping it around a little bit. Um, I blew out one of the foams in this run on the uh, front passenger side but it's blown no need to stop running it just keep on going because if you know the Qatars you know that they don't have a very tall profile so um, you know it, it's let's just see what happens from here <laughs> that's all I can say but um but yeah I blew the foam out so I gotta get another set of these and see what happens from there uh oh all right so um you know put your comments down below on what you think about this run here now we're about to see how it moves with with a set of hooms on me personally i think the hooms actually work best on uh infraction or limitless not this monster truck setup i don't know why but it's just something that they did with it with with the homes working with those particular vehicles that make it drift the way that it drifts it handles the way that it handles it's actually really really good on that setup i don't really like it like them too much on here um yeah i'm, I'm still not sold on this setup just yet just whip it around a little bit longer you know of course like i said before put your, your comments your thoughts down below or your feedback too you know, hey try these times try those times you know whatever it is and kind of go from there but yeah the hooms just don't they don't stick as as well as i would like them to um and not just like maybe if i can drift it it's a little wide for drifting because it is as wide as an outcast. Um, but yeah, it doesn't it doesn't drift well, you know, like a true infraction or a true limit does, you know, when you when you're going through those curves like like we all know we can. Yep. So I tried to do, um, a, you know, go in reverse and then do a 180. It, it didn't work out too well. I'm just glad I didn't flip it over like I did when I tried it with the um, <laughs> Super Baja Ray.
But yeah, just whipping it around a little bit in this parking lot. Um, it handles cool with, with the hooms on there. I, I think it does better with the back flips, but the, the hooms are they're cool. Now, a couple of times, I didn't, I didn't record this one, but I ran it before with the guitars on here on, on concrete. Not good at all. Worst traction. The traction was worse than this. Now here it is with a set of power hobby wheels and tires. Now the power hybrid wheels and tires are supposed to compete with the the SRC street pressures and terrain pressure. You have to try a set for yourself to, to see if you like it or not. I personally, I just think they're okay. Um, you know, I ran them a few times on a couple of different rigs and they just, they just didn't move me. If I had to choose between the SRC terrain crushers or street crushers and these power hobbies, I would choose <laughs> yeah, no, uh, I'm, I'm keeping my opinion to myself on which one I would pick, but um, I like the back flip the best of the six that's out there. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Um, so yeah, I, I ran them a little bit on here. It, it, I, I don't know if it's because the wheel isn't balanced or whatever, but it just, it just doesn't do right. And that was on, on the lower setting um with the controller but overall i think i'll be going back to to my original setup with my back flips so thanks for watching and i appreciate your time